We are here with breaking news, Ukrainian forces destroyed a Russian vehicle. During the battles, one of the Russian vehicles has been destroyed by Ukrainian forces. We are here with the last-minute developments of the day. Don't forget to like the video before moving on to the news. Stone News is here to convey to you the news developments of the day. The war has been going on in a contentious way. It has been 161 days since the first attack of Russia against Ukraine. Russian army is still trying to take control of Ukraine. Both armies have been going their best for six months. In the evening of 2 August, Russia launched missiles from Caspian Sea. Seven out of eight missiles of Russia have been destroyed by the air defense of Ukraine. According to information received from Yuri Inet, spokesperson of the Air Forces Command of the Armed Forces of Ukraine, Russian army last evening approximately at 5 p.m. launched a missile attack from Caspian Sea. Russian army used strategic fighter aircraft 295. In total of eight cruise missiles of the X-101, X-555, type were launched in the direction of the central, southern and western oblasts of Ukraine. Ukrainian army managed to down seven missiles of Russia. Six Russian missiles were hit by anti-aircraft missile forces, and another was hit by a fighter pilot of the armed forces of Ukraine. Unfortunately, last missile hit an anti-aircraft missile system of Ukraine in Lviv Oblast. Information about victims and damage has not been announced. The total loss of the Russian army over the past 24 hours has been announced. Today, Russia has lost 180 soldiers. The total manpower loss has reached to 41,350. These losses are not good for Russian army because Russia is already struggling with shortage of military personnel. Russian army is trying to increase its troops in Ukraine but has difficulty to find new infantries. Russian people refuse to fight in Ukraine. In addition, Russia lost six tanks, eight armored fighting vehicles, three artilleries, one air defense systems, eight automotive equipment and tankers and one tactical unmanned aircraft. These losses enrage Russian authorities. Enraged Russian authorities keep ordering new missions to Russian soldiers to achieve a success. However, Russian soldiers struggle to achieve and leave the battlefield without success. Ukrainian army inflicted losses on Russian army once again. Another news about this issue has been announced. According to breaking news, Ukrainian forces destroyed a Russian vehicle. During the battles in South Slash East a Russian vehicle has been destroyed. After the destruction of the vehicle, it exploded again with ammunition detonates. It can be said that Ukrainian army not only destroyed a Russian vehicle and also heavy ammunition of Russia.